happy Saturday and welcome back to my channel. It is Saturday, April 6th and it's currently 7.41. We have 20 minutes or 19 minutes until Drew's 24 hour reading starts, readathon starts. And so welcome to my first ever 24 hour readathon. Uh, I'm so excited to be documenting my first ever 24 hour readathon. Um, I'll be updating you guys between my phone and the camera. Um, so what is my 24 hour readathon TBR going to be like? Um, I'll be, re I'm going to be trying to read five books. I'm going to be trying to finish Siege and Storm by Lee Bardugo. Um, it's the second book in the Gushiverse, and it's the book I'm currently reading, so I want to be able to try to finish that. I am also going to start, to, I'm also going to try to read Three Dark Crowns by Kent Kendara Blake. Um, it's the first book in the trilogy, or I heard there might be more books, so I'm excited to read, pick up this book and read it. Uh, I'm also going to, be going to be trying to read Restore Me by Tahir Mafi. Um, this is the fourth book in the Shadow Me series, and um, To Find Me just came out, and I want to be able to read Restore Me before I read To Find Me. Um, another book that's on my 24-hour readathon TBR is Cookie Kingdom by Leigh Bardugo. This is the second book in the Six of Crows series. Um, I'm excited to read this, because with how Six of Crows ended, I've been wanting to pick up um, Crook and Kingdom since February, but I had other books to read, so I want to try to read this today. Last, but not least, on my 24-hour readathon book that I'm going to try to read, it happens to be Legendary by Stephanie Garber, which is book two in the Car of All series. Um, the third book comes out in May, and I definitely needed to read Legendary before I read Finale. So those are the... Four books I planned, and the fifth book is downstairs. Um, so the readathon starts at 8 a.m. today, and it goes until 7:55 in the morning tomorrow. Um, I will probably end up taking a nap at some point to try to be able to stay up through the night. I might fall asleep because I do have to go to work early tomorrow. Um, but I will try to. Um, I have to be at work for 9, and so I tend, to, I will be leaving my house, like, around 7.30, so I'll miss the ending part of the readathon, but I'm going to try to, try to finish my, I'll try to finish my stack beforehand. So, that is the update, and I will update you once the readathon starts. Happy evening, guys, and thank you for, so much for joining me on this journey. Hey, guys. Um, it's later in the day. And it's 24 hour readathon day. Um, I wanted to finish Siege and Storm by Lee Bardugo because that was the book I was currently reading before the readathon, before I started my TBR part, which I, I mentioned earlier. Um, well, reading update. I finished my first book. I finished Siege and Storm by Lee Bardugo. And let me tell you, this book, I was literally at the edge of my seat, or my bed in this case, saying, ah, through the whole thing. This story and this universe, I'm now getting so much better at understanding it. Because um, when I first read The Six of Crows, I had no idea how the magic system worked, which is why I picked up Shadow and Bone last month. Which is why when I finally, I read Siege and Storm, I could not put it down. I could not put down all, all 400 and... I think it's 31. Yeah. 431 pages of the story. No, 432. All 432 pages of this book. I can up and down. Uh, I started it a week ago. And, like, or just a couple of days ago, actually, I started it Tuesday. Um, and since then, I couldn't put it down. And today, B 
being the readathon, I cannot put it down. I finished my first book of the readathon. I'm so excited. I think I'm going to pick up Crooked Kingdom now because I'm kind of in the mood to continue with Leigh Bardugo's writing. But I'm so happy that I finished my first book of the readathon. Ah! Um, and I will update you guys soon. Happy reading. Peace. Hey guys, I wanted to update you. I had finished Seeds and Storm and I said I was going to start Crooked Kingdom. But I decided I wanted to do something that was less bulky as um, Crooked Kingdom. Which happens to be 536 pages. So I decided to pick up Three Dark Crowns by Kintara Blake. And I'm loving the story so far. I'm already on... What page am I on? I'm currently already on page 44. So I'm flying through it. It's a nice, small um, read, which I'm enjoying. And it's only 398 pages. Um, so it's under 400 pages, so I'm very excited to continue reading Three Dark Crowns, and then I might pick up Legendary, but we'll see. Um, I wanted to update you with what I was doing and what book I decided to read next. I'm already flying through Three Dark Crowns, so I will update you in a little while. I currently have the WWE Hall of Fame playing on in the background, and they're going to be reading. It's, it's a wonderful night. So, happy reading. Hey guys, it's later uh, at night. Um, and I'm going with you with a reading update. Uh, so, I finished Siege and Storm earlier. And I decided to start Three Dark Crowns. Um, and I was also going to read Crooked Kingdom. So, I've read a little bit more of Crooked Kingdom. I am now on page... I'm on page 60 of Crooked Kingdom. I'm enjoying it so far. Uh, I'm definitely liking the the POVs that we're getting in this book so far. I'm really enjoying it. I'm excited to continue reading with this. And again, like I said, I'm also reading Three Dark Crowns. Um, it's really excited. I might, uh, I'm enjoying it thoroughly. Uh, I'm on page 164 of Three Dark Crowns, and I've definitely, it's one of the reasons why I picked up Three Dark Crowns and Crooked Kingdom. I knew I definitely wanted a book that I could kind of fly through, and that's what I'm doing with Three Dark Crowns. Um, I am actually going to continue reading. I might end up falling asleep, but I'm going to set a timer for myself that if I do fall asleep, I'll wake up and I'll continue reading. And that way I get some sleep today. So we'll see how that goes. I will definitely update you sooner or later. I don't know, but happy reading. Hey guys, it's currently 4.08 4 in the morning. Um, I just woke up after sleep for a little bit. Because uh, I need to sleep. Cause I have work today. It's going to be a long day. And I'm, I need sleep. Um... So I'm going to pick up three dark crowns again and continuing until I have to leave for work. But I'll update you soon. Bye, guys. Well, reading update. I finished three dark crowns by Kandara Blake, and it was a really good story. Um, I enjoyed it. Um, there are parts that were slow and stuff that I didn't like. Which is why I give four out of five stars. But altogether, this is a great read. I was able to finish it. Um, so it was really good. Um, I think I'm going to pick up either Restore Me or Legendary or Six uh, Crooked Kingdom. We'll see. We still have about two hours left of this readathon. Yeah. So. Peace. Hey guys, it's the end of the 24 hour readathon. I ended up falling back asleep because I'm not used to being awake this late. Um, but 
I did read more out to finish the Dark Crowns. I read some more of the Crooked Kingdom. Um, I got to page 96, which is good. So I've almost hit 100 pages for Crooked Kingdom. I loved it. Um, what I go in with the readathons read is I read as much as I can. I don't, yes, I've had like certain books that I want to finish, but at the same time, if I don't finish them or if I don't even get to them, that's fine. Um, cause I'll be still reading them in the, in the month. Um, it's interesting to see how I would record the readathon. And I, I did some of it. Um, it's not going to be long cause I really, I focused on reading and not having my camera constantly on me. Um, I do plan to get better at vlogging. Um, I'm going to be actually starting a new, a week long reading vlog today from Sunday to next Sunday. Um, which I'm going to shoot after this, but I wanted to give you the update that, um, I did finish at least two books this readathon. I finished Siege and Storm by Lee Bardugo and I finished Three Dark Crowns by Kendara Blake. Both great books. Um, it was fun doing the readathon. I did, at least I got up at like far away and I finished Theodore Crowns. That was a really good plus for me. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you for joining me and I hope to talk to you guys soon. Bye.